If you live or work in Chicago, how safe are you feeling tonight? Beginning this week, the city is limiting its response to 911 calls. People no longer come right away <clears throat> to reports of things like criminal damage to property, vehicle theft, garage burglaries, or what they call simple assaults. Is this good or bad for Chicagoans? We ask our CBS2 Jim Williams to take a look. On the very block where burglars broke into a home on Christmas Day, Carmen Curio has a strong opinion on the city's new 911 response plan. Well, what do you think about the idea that police may not respond to every single burglary call? I think that's ridiculous. I think if there's a burglary, they got to come. The alderman here in the 36th ward on the northwest side says his constituents pay high property taxes, so it's not asking too much after a traumatic break in for a police visit. People are upset. They want to talk to a police officers. They want to know something's being done to prevent this from the future. Police Superintendent Gary McCarthy insists crime prevention in the future happens when officers are on patrol, not tied up, taking reports at the scene of nonviolent incidents. I don't mean to be flippant here because I've been a victim of a burglar at least three or four times. I'd rather have the officer on the street where we could prevent the shooting. Police say they will still respond to 911 burglary calls if the suspect is at the scene or if they're convinced the criminal can be arrested right away. You're upset. You're violated. It's happened to me. So you got to weigh it. And I'm making tough decisions. Tough decisions because of the city's financial woes. Still, McCarthy told us Chicago police respond to 70 percent of 911 calls. In other cities, he says, police go to 30 to 50 percent of emergency calls. Bill and Walter police say sworn officers will still take information about crimes at the district station or over the phone, even if officers do not respond in person. Well, a tip, there's a burglar in my house. That's an immediate threat. And if they think they can arrest one, they'll, they'll come. come. Now, that, that story we told you about, the house that was burglarized in the 36th Ward, police did come on Christmas Day. The suspects were still in the area. Oh, there was a foot chase. They grabbed them. This Good. is well, this going to be a yeah. really hot potato yeah. politically, yeah. really. Could be. <laughs> That's how you, how you say it.